what is the difference about a Hemi engine compared to a normal big block like a 427 Corvette engine? Okay. Well, there was a handful of 427s, but it all comes down to the name Hemi. What is a hemispheric? What what is a hemispherical engine versus a wedge style engine? Okay. Um, this is a hemispherical piston. All right. You see the dome. It's a dome. It's not flat. Okay. It's not flat. It doesn't have a raise. And what are these? What are these reliefs in the piston for? Intake valve comes from this angle. Exhaust valve comes from this angle. All right. So air goes in, air goes out. Hemispherical. So your flow is a very gentle, mild arc. It's like a 23 degree arc. It goes whoop, goes right through there. Okay. Hemispherical piston. Um, a wedge style piston, whether it's a Mopar, whether it's a 427 side oiler, or a 454 LS6 big block Chevelle, the wedge style, the wedge style, uh, wedge style cylinder head. I should be talking about cylinder heads, not pistons, but the cylinder head has both the intake and exhaust on one side. All right. And the spark plug is on a countering side. I forgot to mention on a hemispherical intake spark plug exhaust. So air goes in ignition. Piston goes down. Piston comes up, piston goes down, exhaust goes out. Okay. So all that being said is on a wedge style, on a wedge style cylinder head, air goes in, gets sparked, goes back out, loops around. Okay. It has to make a U-turn going through the cylinder head. And that is... Slow flow. <laughs> All right. Because you have you have a lot of energy in reversing that flow out of the head. That cylinder head, and that's and Chrysler has it, Ford has it, GM has it, AMC had it, all the old muscle cars had it, modern cars had it, was that kind of intake and exhaust flow out of the head. Well, the most efficient is a hemispherical head. And if you look, I hate to say it, but your modern Sea-Doo, your modern Yamaha, your modern Cowie is more or less a, a, a semi-hemispherical head. It has exhaust and intake with a spark plug in the middle. It's a hemispherical head. Even if it might be a flat top piston, it's a hemispherical head. So it's, it's optimized flow. Ultimately, you want the smoothest, the smoothest flow, the most interrupted flow possible. That's the idea. Hey guys, thanks for hanging out. This clip was taken from our weekly podcast that we record here every Sunday night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you want to watch the whole video, you can go to the Watercraft Journal's YouTube channel, go to playlists, and then click on live sessions. You're going to see it there. Otherwise, go ahead and leave a like, a comment, and definitely subscribe to the channel. It helps us grow. And again, thanks again for watching our videos, and we hope to see you soon.